Hello, my name is Khan Hall. I'm one of the pediatric cardiologists at the Heart Institute at Cincinnati Children's Hospital Medical Center. My field of interest is cardiac imaging, and I focus on uh, Duchenne muscular dystrophy using cardiac MRI to assess uh, cardiac function using strain. Patients with Duchenne muscular dystrophy has an absolute genetic risk of having heart disease. The, d the defect in the dystrophin gene, uh, pro uh, dystrophin protein, results in replacement of fat replacement of the muscle, re uh, which results in the inability of the heart to pump normally. Duchenne muscular dystrophy affects uh, the uh, boys, uh, which results in loss of muscle function in both the skeletal and cardiac muscle, um, resulting in loss of emulation and uh, decrease uh, loss of heart function. We've been working in the clinical side, looking at the Duchenne muscular dystrophy patient uh, in the heart function, which has led into the multiple publication. This resulting in bridging both the basic science and the clinical science, which has resulted in uh, our ability to start the study. The plurinone trial study is in hopes to be able to use an old medication called a plurinone, uh, which is an aldosterone uh, antagonist, uh, which has been shown to help decrease the uh, rate of scar, scar formation in adult uh, heart attack patients because patients with Duchenne muscular dystrophy develops um, muscle fibrosis. We hope that using this in patients will help delay the muscle fibrosis which would lead, lead to the uh, abnormal heart function. The hope of this trial is to, to extend the quality of life uh, in, the, in the boys with Duchenne by improving their function for longer periods of time. At this stage, there's no current definitive treatment, and while we're waiting for stem cell uh, transplant to occur, we're giving the opportunity for these patients to live longer, but with a good quality of life and maintaining their normal heart function.